What is up everybody and welcome to another episode of Dave Steals the Show. Guys, I have some serious beef. And I mean some serious beef with Blackberry. Two reasons. The first, I went out and I purchased their Blackberry Key One and I loved this phone. Until the screen fell off. Then I had to send it back. And they sent me a replacement. And I loved that phone. Until the screen fell off. Again, look. I just noticed this, look. Can you see that? Can you see that? Huh? Is that good quality craftsmanship? Is that good build quality? I don't think so, Blackberry. Very, very frustrating. The other thing is that within probably six to seven months after I was using it, the lag got so bad, so bad. It would take like five or six seconds just to open up the camera. Come on, what are you talking about? This thing is supposed to be awesome. I love Blackberry. I never had a screen come off of a Blackberry before. Not before TCL took over and started making these things. Now the screens are falling off. Very, very frustrating. The second thing that's really bothering me is the fact that I can't get the BlackBerry Key 2. They hyped up this phone. All the improvements that we wanted made from this phone, they made in the BlackBerry Key 2. They made the keys bigger. They're a matte finish instead of this glossy mess that they made. The build quality looks to have improved. They promised that no screens will fall off of these phones, right? There's just one little problem with the BlackBerry Key 2. Do you guys know what that is? Do you know what that is? Let me tell you what that is. It's not available for Verizon wireless users. It's not available for Verizon wireless users. How am I going to do a review on a phone, use it as my daily driver so I can report back to you guys my opinion on the phone when I can't get it for my carrier? That sucks. If you're on at and T-Mobile, Sprint, no problem, you can get it. This phone is gonna be available for GSM networks. But if you're stuck on a CDMA network like Verizon Wireless, the phone's not available. I can't get it. So now what am I gonna do? So BlackBerry, if for some reason there's an opportunity for you guys to release this phone, maybe at a later date for the CDMA networks, please do that because I want to get this phone. I want to have, listen to me, I want to have a Blackberry in my hand. I want one. But you're telling me I can't have one. And that is a problem. Blackberry, help me help you. Help me help you. I, I want you guys to sell units. I want to get one. I was going to buy one. Review it. Give it a glorious review if it's that great, and hopefully other people would buy it. But because I can't even get my hands on one because you're not offering it for my network, I cannot do that, and therefore it could possibly be impacting millions of dollars of sales. Actually, probably only two or three people, but that's neither here nor there. That doesn't matter. What matters is I can't get it. It's very frustrating. So for all of you who have and get your hands on a key to, comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know how you like it. I'm not going to switch to AT&T or T-Mobile just to get my hands on this phone. So I'm going to have to skip this round and hopefully the next BlackBerry they release will be available on the CDMA network for Verizon Wireless or Maybe they'll release a Verizon version later in the year. I hope they do. Until then, I'm going to have this Key 1, which I have to return now. 
and get a replacement for. And all I can do is start looking forward to the announcement of the Samsung Galaxy Note 9, which is coming around the corner. So if you're interested in that phone, stick around because I know Samsung's gonna release a phone on all carriers. So stay tuned, I'll have that phone, I'll review it. Then behind that one is gonna be the new iPhones. And then right behind that is gonna be the Google Pixel 3 and 3XL. I'm hoping to get my hands on all three of those phones so that we can talk about them here on this channel. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you all next week.